somebody celebrated six years the end of this month. Six years. Six years of service, six years of gratitude, six years of a relationship, six years on a job, six years in school, six years old. Somebody was celebrating um, their child's uh, sixth birthday. Take it where it resonates. You almost um, passed your six weeks at the job. Looking forward to the 90 days. Coming up, she we in 2022. That equals six too. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's something that's going on. Um, that uh, it, it it has something to do with um awards, awards, accolades. Um, it has something to do with being present in this energy that is surrounding you. Um, it has something to do with you releasing and, um, finishing this transition, this cycle, cause it's coming to a close and it has a lot to do with past life, your past life, karmic debt, um, family, soul ties, everything, everything is coming to a completion at the end of this month. One thirty-two. I just saw on the clock. Stay positive. You got your ascended masters all around you. And the universe wants you to cooperate. Cooperate with them. Cooperate with your spiritual team. Cooperate with Mother Earth. Cooperate with Most High and your angels. Understand what's going on with you and yours is what I'm hearing. Understand what's going on with you and yours. First, understand you. Understand your body. Understand your psyche. Your likes, your dislikes, hone in on that shit right now and recognize, analyze, and realize that abundance is your right. Period. Abundance is your right. Um, don't let nobody tell you different. And you gotta be aware about what your higher self is trying to have you focus on. You know? about your physical well-being and about this physical d dimension. You know, it's, 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 it's natural for you to believe that it's some limitations is what I'm seeing, but your soul is limitless and your soul has the ability to give out and receive energy. Adapting, you know what I'm saying? Adapt to this cycle that you're in. Don't adapt to any low vibing energy though. You just got to be able to accept that you are capable and you worthy of this shit, period, point blank. And the universe is giving you everything that you desire. The end of this month is what I keep hearing. It's like somebody been on the one-way street, but it's about to be a U-turn, a return, a loop. This energy that's coming towards you is very abundant and, and, and it got to flow. It got to flow straight to you, but you got to be willing to send it right back out. Don't let that fly over your head. Everything that you want can be yours, but you got to accept the energy that you are in right now. And you have to accept that this energy, it, it, it just don't end with you. Everybody has this right to be abundant. It's your right. It's your right to be a, a, a dumpster for blessings. You hear me? For boundless love, happiness, prosperity, good health, all these gifts. With your intentions and shit, you know, the intentions that you set, the intentions that you've been setting is going to flow. And this abundance, this Jesus saying, is going to stay alive, but you can't block your intentions by limiting your mindset. You got to say to the universe what you want and, and mean it. And don't worry about whether or not you are going to receive it or if you're worthy of receiving it. Nothing that Jesus is saying. Nothing is what your spirit guides are saying. Nothing is further from the truth. That ain't nothing but your ego. And they want you to shed your ego. 441 on the clock. You chosen to shed your ego. The universe always telling you, yeah, but it's your ego. They be telling you, no, I can't do it. Oh, no, the, the, the universe ain't my benefactor. 
No, all the gifts that you want, you can accept it. But you just got to know that that shit is possible. And that is yours is what I'm hearing. The end of this month, somebody's celebrating. A, the collective is celebrating an anniversary is what I'm hearing. It's your anniversary. Made for you and me. You done got over a lot. That's what I just heard. You've gotten over a lot. You've been critically thinking about your, your, your path. You've been looking in the rear view, but I heard the only reason why you're looking in the rear view is to, you know, consult with your higher self to see if, if this is the same shit Rick Road or, you know, what is it that I should do? Yeah, what is it that I should do? It's somebody who scorned in your energy, too. Somebody who is irritated with you, but um, we're not going to let that mess up this abundant right, is what the Jesus said. You heard it. We're not going to let this mess up that abundant right. We're going to see what else they got to say. This is a collective reading. I appreciate all y'all from coming through and, you know, supporting the channel. Give it a thumbs up or give it a thumbs down. Any gesture would be lovely. You understand what I'm saying? These are our messages from our spiritual team. I'm here to ring the alarm, let you know about karmic activity, and let you know what path you want. you always on your destined path. You understand what I'm saying? you always on your destined path. It's just whether or not you are recognizing, analyzing, and realizing that you on your destined path. The shit that you went through was your path as well. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what the G's just said. That's what they just said. This diagnosis. Vegetarian. Somebody taken. Somebody taken. Spoken for. You ain't single no more. You ain't single no more. And at the bottom, I see domestic violence. Goody, goo, goo, goo. And up under that, I... Bullshit. Yeah, that's what I see. Up under your knees. Your knees, domestic violence, somebody is menopausal. Um, <clears throat> I see you looking at this, this limousine in traffic. You know, like, what are you doing riding through the gato? Um, yeah, what are you doing riding through the gato? <laughs> the ghetto. The, the ghetto. Talking about the ghetto. <laughs> funky, funky ghetto music. So listen, been some sort of diagnosis. We gonna see what's going on, though. Um, this domestic violence, you know, mm -hmm. that's some Porky the Pig bullshit because, god damn it, <laughs> yeah, I said Porky the Pig bullshit, referencing, um, the cops, referencing the cops, well, who want to catch a domestic violence? Damn, you got so much you need to be celebrating at the end of this month, is what I'm hearing, this DV is, 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 is not going to be a blemish on your record. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to be a blemish. That's going to be something that's going to be there, male or female. What the fuck? Keep your hands to yourself. If you feel like you got to wring somebody's neck, you your, your ancestors and your spirit guys ain't got to tell you to walk away. You know, that's the logical thing to do. Motherfucker had you locked up, all up out of your hookup and shit, performing. Mm-mm. No, no, no. Diagnosis, spirit. What's this diagnosis? What is this diagnosis, spirit? Emperor. Emperor. So, this emperor is going through some karma. This emperor is going through some karma. King of Cups. This emperor is going through some karma, but this emperor is is being a gangster about it, being a soldier. Um, yeah, being a soldier, but that's that's this emperor's nature to be bigger than vile, to not let his um, emotions and his feelings show. 
feel as though, you know, this emperor don't want to play neither. This emperor is not in a playing mood. Not at all. This emperor is not in a playing mood. This this emperor is trying to stabilize some shit. But this emperor then got all up out of his hookup. And I feel as though, you know, he, he, he banking on some shit too. He banking on some shit. Somebody forced this emperor to get up off of his square. To get up off of his square. Period. Point blank. This this emperor is somebody who's always thinking. You know what I'm saying? Shit. This emperor's mind is like a hamster wheel. A critical thinker. You know, always trying to be logical. And you know, the who, the whens, the wheres, the whys. It's always a why and a what for this emperor. Um, this emperor, you know, I'm looking at some sort of juggling here. This, you know, some, some sort of juggling, some sort of games that's being played. Um, this emperor been trying to school people though. This emperor too, you know, this emperor deals with a lot of, um, money. Yeah, and, and you know, this, the, I'm seeing an officer. I'm seeing an officer. I'm seeing somebody who's young. I'm seeing somebody who's flamboyant too. Very flamboyant. And at the back, at the bottom of the deck, you know, this judgment is a lawsuit. With that domestic violence, God damn it, keep your hands to yourself, bro. Why you want to go get the people's your time? Your time. Your time for putting your hands on a woman. You know what I'm saying? Balance that shit out, bro. What is it? Money? That's what I'm seeing. It's something about these coins and this, you know, this lavish life. You know, being comfortable with this with this six of pentacles is like like I said earlier, you being present with this energy right now, but not relying on it. Not relying on it because it is something it, it's like whatever it is that the this emperor is being fed is some bullshit. It's like, I can't digest this shit. Quit lying to me. Quit lying to me. Mm-hmm. Quit, quit lying to me. Something has been raised from the dead. It's some old shit, too. It's some old shit. It's a lot of he say, she say shit. It's a lot of he say, she say shit, too. Whether or not, you know, what's being said is some actual factuals. If it's coming from a loving place, uh, a place of divinity, or if it's, if it's coming from fucking Hades. You understand what I'm saying? Somebody is holding on to what was said. What was said. They've been thinking about that shit. They've been thinking about that shit. It was, it's, it's something that got to do with a message. It got to do with, you know... Somebody being given, somebody giving something to some, giving something to this emperor. Mm-hmm. Somebody gave something to this emperor. Somebody gave something to this emperor. What's this vegetarian? I feel as though this vegetarian, though, you know, even before I pull some cards, let them fly, this vegetarian, you know, with this diagnosis, um, somebody quit eating meat, red meat. Pink meat, ain't nobody eating meat. Whoever died, this emperor ain't eating meat. This emperor says you can eat his meat, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is what just fell. This emperor says you can eat his meat, though. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So this emperor didn't shed it and did it a lot, you know, uh, for his physical well-being. For his physical well-being. Because at the bottom of the deck, whatever the fuck this diagnosis is, made this emperor go, what the fuck? Put them in this hateful ass energy. And somebody been taken from them. They took a lot of this emperor's time. Took a lot. Took up too much motherfucking mental space is what I just heard. Okay. Yeah, I'm a thinker. I'm a critical thinker, but you got me thinking about the wrong shit, bitch, is what I just heard. Oh, shit. Somebody do got bodies. Somebody got bodies. Somebody is a fucking sex fiend. A sex fiend. And 
it's like on this chapter, this chapter, and especially when somebody is celebrating, somebody's celebrating six something, somebody's celebrating like shit. No, I'm not about to go back for you, son of a biscuit eater. Is what I'm hearing. I ain't about to go motherfucking backwards. I'm one step close to where it is. I I know I want to be and where my spiritual team want me to be. Then you right. Your soul been screaming at you. Your, mm-hmm, your higher self been screaming at you, telling you that it's a one-way street. It's like a loop. You know what I'm saying? A loop of, 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 of stank-ass energy that's trying to, you know, cut off your abundance. Mm-hmm. Cut off your abundance. Um, yeah. Trying to cut off your abundance. Um, but this lover's card at the bottom, it's like something has started. Something started. Some type of love had bloomed. But it's like this love for self is, is, is just starting to. Somebody shedding the ego and all this love that's being thrown at them. You know what I'm saying? With their magic stick that they've been working. You know what I'm saying? Somebody else been working their magic stick as well. Somebody been trying to motherfucking pull the wool over this emperor's eyes. This divine masculine is pissed the fuck off. But, you know what I'm saying? He keeping his composure. He keeping his composure. But this domestic violence is going to take the fuck off. It's going to take the fuck off is what I'm hearing. Mm. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, Scorpio energy is what I'm hearing. Um, inspiration been cut off. Inspiration been cut off. What I'm hearing with this single and this taking, talking, this love that just started blooming, you know, something started blooming elsewhere as well. <clears throat> yeah, something started blooming elsewhere as well. And and this emperor was uh forgotten about. This emperor were, was forgotten about. The vibe was off. The vibe was off. This person that you, 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 you're dealing with or you're about to cut loose or you're about to try to yoke up. You know, the vibration is off. And, and you wanted someone to match your vibe. And this is not it, bro. This is not it. it this is not it. And... It's like you you well known, you know what I'm saying, and and you thinking more so about your status and your reputation, and I'm hearing um I'm I'm, I'm hearing also what's being thought of is, is 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 this person wanting to argue you to the end, and 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 y'all on a new fucking phase, a new chapter, a new beginning. And this person is frustrating the fuck out of you. It's like, quit lying. Don't act like you ain't straight from Bills or Bob's motherfucking goddamn. This motherfucker look like a little too. Y'all remember the cartoon, the littles? Look, they, <laughs> this person look like a little. This person look like a little. And they giving up the smallest details about what's going on in y'all world. The smallest details about what's going on in y'all world. Somebody was caught naked. Somebody was caught naked. I'm also hearing that you've been spiritually blessed. You've been spiritually blessed. I'm hearing you've been spiritually blessed. Your your crown chakra is activated so much. <laughs> so much. But you know, whoever this person is, they've been trying to uh make it so that you you sound crazy. Like you sound crazy when you when you telling them what it is that you know. And it's like how how are you getting this information? Bitch, I am tapped. And I am tapped in. I am tapped in. And I heard an owl's nest. Somebody saw an owl's nest. I want to see an owl's nest too. Somebody got hair like Medusa. Somebody got hair like Medusa. And somebody got the nerve to have an attitude 
You know what I'm saying? Because a little birdie done told on him. Because a little birdie done told on him. Um, somebody dealing with um someone outside of their race and someone within their race. But like I said, somebody is remaining a soldier too. If some shit is coming around quick and it might be that slap to the face. So I'm here to let you know that you don't need to do that. I'm I'm here to let you know that you need to shadow box. You got to accept the good with the bad is what I'm hearing. You got to accept the good with the bad because whoever this woman is, bruh, she got a bunch of secrets. She do. She sit on her throne with a with a stinking ass attitude, you know, always worried about how she looking. I mean, what, what woman up? But she's very vain, very vain, like vanity. You know, she, 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 she's very, very, very vain. Um, you got people who look at her side-eyed, who's very close to you. Medusa hair is what I just heard. Medusa hair. 2108 on the clock. It's like two, somebody is about to... Dipset. Somebody about to about to leave. I think that's what you should do. You thought about it. You know, I think that's what you should do, but to each his own, this person is trying to fuck your world up, period. And trying to mess with your fortune. Your abundant right. Mm-hmm. This domestic violence, this diagnosis and all that other shit. You understand what I'm saying? These heavy burdens, most high said, give it to him. Give it to him. It's gonna be a lawsuit. And this lawsuit, you ain't going to be able to get up out of that shit for putting your hands on that tattoo. You ain't. You ain't going to be able to do it. You ain't going to be able to do it. You're not. You're not. This high priestess energy. Very spiritually inclined. You are. Did I not say that already? Did I not say that? That your crown chakra is lit up on purpose. On purpose, boo-boo. On purpose. I see roses. Somebody's name may be Rose. I see roses. I see a bunch of gaudy flowers. A bunch of gaudy flowers and tomatoes. I don't know where that's coming from. I see a bunch of gaudy flowers and a bunch of tomatoes. What's up with this taking spirit? Somebody... Yeah, somebody is out here playing in Lake Minnetonka. Somebody got a husband, a wife, a mister, a mistress. And, you know, they really ain't been paying attention to who they lap full of coochie, a lap full of dick at the house. Period. Point blank. And it is a lot of love elsewhere is what I'm hearing. It's a lot of love elsewhere. It's a lot of lovers. It's a lot of lovers. Somebody most definitely in a magician's energy. You know what I'm saying? And and you got to step into it, but not that dark part. You hear me? Not the dark side. Not the dark side. No, nickel. I said N-I-C-C-A. No, nickel. No, no, no. You got to shadow box. You got to you gotta leave that karmic energy alone. You heard what I said. Abundance is your right. You heard what the G said. Abundance is your right. So guess what? Why you why you feeling as though you stuck on soup and a lockdown on dumb and ain't no forward movement? It's some forward movement because your G's is moving some shit out the motherfucking way. They want you to avoid this broad, avoid this woman, avoid this karmic feminine. Uh, they gonna want to win at all costs. Is what I'm hearing. They gonna want to win at all costs, and it's already. You know, I just heard it's, it's, it's some other gentlemen in their path that they done sent straight to the clink, to the paint, to the can, man. They ain't got no problem with sending you to the motherfucking pokey. They ain't got no problem with sending you to the pokey. No, she don't want to fight back. She don't want to fight back. She is going to dial 911. 911. Mm hmm. It's Tyra for your own good. And the G's don't want you to panic. There's some shit going on with this diagnosis, right? 
Mm -hmm. There's a lot of people involved. And you're going to pinpoint them all because your spirit guides are going to place them on your path. This tower is for your own good. This dismantling of this relationship is for your own good. Because abundance is your right. You have the right to be happy in a relationship, in a connection. You have the right to be well off. All that's on the back burner, though, because it's especially these coins, because of who you're dealing with. The G's don't want them to have no parts of that man. <laughs> no parts of that man. Let's see what else and I'm going to cut on my body here. Ain't nothing but love. Ain't nothing but love. I feel like ain't nothing but love for y'all. And I, I feel like, you know, this is somebody that uh, this emperor has placed a ring on, on, on this woman's finger. And this woman don't mean you no good, baby. This woman don't mean you no good. You took her and somebody else took her. I feel like she an immigrant, too. I feel like she an immigrant, meaning, you know, she ain't even cut from the same cloth as you, bro. Period. Okay, that might be a good thing, but she ain't cut from the same cloth as you, bruh. Mm, period. Pac-Man, that's the police who gonna come and holler at you. Yeah, she deal with Pac-Man. She deal with the police. She she know the police. She know the officers because she done sent somebody to jail before. And if this is something that you don't know about it. You might know about it, but this is what you need to know. They have roundtable discussions about you. They have been trying to drain your finances and your abundance on a regular basis. These people have been trying to block out your intuition and stop your shine. Get hip. Get hip. Prison term, five years or better. That's what you're looking at. If you go on and you, lo you yoke up. I just was about to say lope. Somebody loped out. If you yoke up that woman, mm -hmm, what's it, look what's at the bottom. Yes, yes. Five years or better, bruh. You're going to be in the paint. You're going to be in the slammer. In the motherfucking slammer. And that's a generational curse is what I'm hearing from you. Something about some tennis shoes, too. Something about some tennis shoes. You bought somebody some tennis shoes. Somebody bought you some tennis shoes. I'm hearing something about promises being kept. Promises being kept. I'm seeing too that this, you know, your ancestors let you. They've been trying to send you these messages and they want you to listen. Your spirit guide said, try again. This 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 woman has a Jezebel spirit, and that's something that you've been trying to shed and did. You want to be a, a one man woman where she's not a one a, a one woman man. You know what I'm saying? No, she out here in the lake, in the rivers, in the ponds. Mm -hmm. It's some shit that's been moving turtle slow, but your G's about to sit this shit right in your face real soon, baby. If you need me, text me, call me, 216-487-1121. Email me, torianggoddess555 at gmail.com. Even if you just want to vent. If you want to ask a question or two, or if you want to read, you holler at me and we'll discuss, um, we'll discuss the parameters when we, um, speak. Until then, ain't nothing but love, y'all. I want everybody to be safe. Know that tomorrow is the super moon, the sturgeon peak moon. Y'all know it's a lot of shit that's going to be going on, right? Of course you do. Let's stay protected and up on our spiritual protection. Keep these karmics at bay and let's call in our abundance, okay? All right. See ya.